Hello everyone, I'm going to show y'all how to properly make Skylander NFC cards. Um, now, this is something I've had so much trouble on for some reason, like, the regular process that so many YouTube videos have on them just um, doesn't work for some reason. So if any of y'all are having problems, this is probably your video. So I'll have all the right things in the description, I'll have the right cards, the right card reader, all the right links for drivers and stuff like that. So <clears throat> make sure you follow those. Um, I'll show you how to install all of these as well. I have these three links open. Um, these are these two are drivers, and then this one is the Mifair Windows tool that you need to install. Now Super easy to install the libusbk. I click as download, click save, double click. When it prompts you to, click yes. Next, 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 install. That simple. Now, after that's done, <clears throat> you click on MSI installer for PC slash CS or SC driver. Uh, version 4.2.8.0, last updated March 20th, 2018. This and the LibUSBK driver most likely aren't ever getting updated again. And it even says ACR122 is end of life. So, <clears throat> or the ACR122U is end of life. So, no updates are coming. All you have to do is just install this one, the one from 2018, the 4.2.8.0. Click that, click save. Don't ask why there's so many duplicates. Um, click extract to and double click it, double click it again. And then go into setup.exe. Don't click 6486, it will not work properly if you do that. Click yes, then click okay, click next, click next, install. And when that's the song, just click finish. You're all done there. Now, what you're gonna do is you're going to go to the latest version of the Mifair Windows tool. And it, th this will be a link in the description. You don't even have to install the latest. Um, you just go to any Mifair Windows tool version and click install. Even if you don't install the latest version, it will prompt you to go to the latest version and you need to install that latest version. <clears throat> Uh, press more info and press run anyway once you open up the installer um, Before you install this turn off your antivirus so your antivirus doesn't delete any necessary files Because trust me it will screw up the process Now just click finish and you should be done uh, There's nothing really to customize when um, Doing like this install or anything like that so all you have to do is just go through the motions. It says a newer version, or a newer pre-release exists. Do you want to go into the GitHub pre-release version or stable version? The pre-release works. The stable version is bugged. I don't know why, but the stable version is just bugged for me. I'm going to click yes anyways, but it says the ACR122U tag reader doesn't seem to be installed. For some reason, it's installed. If you see this error message, please click cancel. And even if um, I unplug it and replug it in again, you know how we installed that libusbk driver, right? Well, guess what? Apparently, Mifair doesn't think we did. Because it says the libusbk is not installed. Do not click OK to install it. Click OK to ruin your card reader and have to... Um, uninstall the drivers and reinstall them again just to get that same exact error message um just make sure you go install the pre-release version to make your life a whole lot easier click save double click that when it's done more info run anyways next next install yes and finish and it opens flawlessly. No problems whatsoever. 
Uh, what I'm going to do, just for safety, is I'm going to unplug my card reader and replug it in. And now the light is flashing red, that's how I know it's working. I'm going to put the card reader up to the microphone so you can hear what it sounds like when I press the card on the card reader. It should make that noise, along with turning the light to green from red. And you should also hear a little Windows notification if you have those activated. Um, thinking of a Skylander to use, I think what I'm going to use, I'm going to use, is it Sunburn? Is that the Skylander? Um, yeah, Sunburn. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and make a Sunburn. I don't think there's any other versions of Sunburn. It's just Sunburn. Well, that sucks. They didn't like Sunburn enough to give them any more versions. Aw, oh, man. Really? You really hate Sunburn that much that you didn't give them any other versions? Wow. Skylanders, I'm so disappointed. Anyways, I'm going to- you're gonna read tag, and press start decode, and make sure standard keys is checked. Make sure it reads properly. If it shows any error messages, read it again. Just like that. Read it again. Start decode and read. And you know it's doing something when it says abort down here. Do not click abort, please don't. It'll cancel the process. Only click abort if any errors are happening. Um, if, okay, this is how you know it's working. If it shows a bunch of sectors and blocks and stuff like that. Perfect. Now, if, the process is taking forever and it's basically showing like a bunch of different keys like a bunch of keys are popping up slowly and it's showing a bunch of blocks and sectors that keep popping up infinitely and anything's just going wrong with your card what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to tools and options you're gonna click change your id you're gonna click format tag then you're gonna type in like something like 36 zeros or 32 zeros sorry the maximum length should be 32 anyways, you can't go past that. Um, and then once you've done that, you just click change UID and it should be fixed. And you can do this whole process all over again. Now what you're gonna do is write tag. And it doesn't matter if there's any like error messages or anything while you're writing the tag. Um, or like, sorry, I, I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself. For some reason, this is loading. Okay, click yes. If it shows any error messages while reading and decoding in this part, it does not matter. I just click yes, just to be safe. It seriously does not matter what it says here. Now it should finish up soon. We're getting sectors and blocks again, which is not a problem. Now, go ahead and click Advanced and click Chinese Magic Unlocked Gen 1. If you don't do this, it will not work. This is how the game will recognize your NFC card as an actual Skylander. Now, you go ahead and select Source Dump. I have a folder of a bunch of dumps. I'm going to leave two links to dumps down in the description below. One's going to be a download link. Another one is going to be a, um, a Google Drive link. Well, I think they're both actually Google Drive. Um, this one seems to work best for me. So, yeah. Just use whichever one you prefer, whichever one works best for you. So I have to go Series 1 Fire Sunburn because there's only a series one sunburn. There's no other sunburns, which is crazy. Now, I already know it's not gonna work because it's on the top one. It's on dump file of tag to copy, series one sunburn, instead of being on blank tag dump file. Uh, now I'm gonna start cloning. 
and that's okay. I know it doesn't work. I'm gonna test it out. I've done this many times though, I know this doesn't work. I'm gonna put it on the portal, and it fails, as expected. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna read the tag again. Showing all the sectors and blocks, a good sign, and this pop-up's a good sign too. The fact that it says, dump keys from series one fire sunburn, this is a good sign when you read it. Now you click right tag, you click yes, make sure standard keys is checked yet again. Always make sure standard keys is checked. Always, always, always. And then just let it read. Now you click advanced and Chinese magic and unlocked again. You click select source dump. You go back to your dumps. And then I'm gonna go back to my series one, that is items, series one sunburn. Let's open that. And the fact that it's on blank tag dump file now means that it's gonna work. This is going to be the scan. Start cloning, click yes. We don't care about this error message because it's completely useless and is lying to us. And... Just wait. Like I said, you know it's doing something when it says abort. And it's done, finished. Press okay. Now, the moment of truth, I'm gonna test it on my console and sunburn pops up. Perfect. So what I've also learned to do is when you're doing this, once you're writing it, once you're done writing a Skylander, if you try to write another one right after this, it will not work and it will just break your card. So I'll actually show you what happens if I try to write another Skylander. Because that error message I told you to um, to um, go to like uh, change the key to like z all zeros and stuff like that. I have so many like errors and stuff like that. I've encountered so many errors that I can just probably like conjure errors on command. So I'm gonna go ahead and read the tag. I'm gonna close this, write the tag, yep. Go ahead. Now, none of this part matters. I'm just trying to get an error um, up so that I can show y'all um, basically um, what this thing looks like. Did I get the error message? Yep, I got it. I know how to get errors on command. <laughs> so this error right here, this isn't good. If you see this, run. No, just kidding. If you see this, what you're gonna do is, actually I'll show you a little bit more so you know if you're getting it. Well, you'd already know by like the massive amount of keys. Um, and so you see like the blocks and sectors, it's gonna repeat a bunch of keys and it's also gonna repeat a crap ton of blocks and sectors. Like, over and over and over again, infinitely. <clears throat> do not wait for this whole entire process, please. Press abort. Do yourself a favor. Click tools and options. Go to change UID. Format tag. And just hold down your zero button until it stops. Because, like I said, it has a maximum character limit. You can actually change it to whatever you want. It doesn't even have to be all zeros. But I'd do it all zeros just to be safe. Click change UID. And it should be done. Just like that. Now your Skylander is saved um, and your card is saved. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this off. When you write a new Skylander, you're going to just close it. I would advise you to unplug your card reader and then you're going to launch MWT again. Click okay. And then go ahead and plug in your card reader and you should be able to make cards like normal again. Oh, this is my fifth time making this video and it actually went smoothly. That's crazy. Anyways, um, I hope you guys don't have any questions and I hope I covered all like these errors and stuff like that.
Um, well, the reason why I say I hope you don't have any questions is because I hope I covered everything. Um, if you do, just leave them in the comments. I'll try to answer them to the best of my ability. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, uh, I hope y'all enjoyed the guide. I hope it helped and um, have a great night, everyone.